we have been waiting for this one, but what is going on, y'all? It's freaking dope to see you guys, man, and I truly hope your day, your week, and you are doing good, man, the best that you can. Let's go! Happy to see you guys, man. I hope your Tuesday is going smooth, as I always say. Shout out to Agent 47 or Master Splinter, man. Good to see you, bruv. I know you've been waiting quite a while for me to get to this one, and... Two things out the gate. Number one, I'm assuming this is going to hit hard just because it's a storyteller. And from the eyes that I checked out before, anytime a storyteller is done, it's always freaking fire, man. Tansky's gonna, done a bunch of them. They're freaking incredible, dude. So you've been waiting for this, man. Rolly storyteller. Big shout out to you guys. Let's get no headphones on because I'm not going to use them. Let's go. <laughs> Media. Man, it even feels good to hear the intro. <laughs> JDZ Media. Roly. What's up, bro? Storyteller. Yeah. Yo. Nice to meet you. This recording, man. Something yeah? ain't right. All these early mornings, all these late nights. Ain't got time to check my doctor. I should make time. I had to tell my bitch, take time. Cause she told me that she pregnant, but it ain't mine. Move oh. Out the gate, bro. All these early days and late nights, word, if you hustling, you don't get a lot of sleep. I told my girl because I need space because she's pregnant, but the baby ain't mine, bruh. Take time, I had to tell my bitch, take time, because she told me that she pregnant, but it ain't mine. Moved it over in my head for like the eighth time. Word. I ain't into getting all depressed. I'm alive, so I am blessed. Sticking out my chest, I'll have a great time. Let's go! Yo. Used to look like Chucky out of Rugrats. Go. <laughs> Heck, ah, shout out to Chucky from Rugrats, bro. But I'm assuming he means it because he got bullied and stuff. Yo, used to look like Chucky out of Rugrats. Got bullied in school. Big glass of ginger hair, big teeth. Word, Always bro. had big dreams. I played guitar, never barred till I was like 15. Let's go! I played guitar, never barred till I was like 15. Word, I feel you on that, bro. I was all about drums and music, and then I found hip hop at like 12. The first song, Still Dre. Dude, that beat is incredible. Let's go. I've always had big dreams. I played guitar, never barred till I was like 15. Yep. Used to want the pretty girls to notice. So I stopped playing football instead of smoke spliffs. Didn't have a clue, you see. Ooh, he's making the change, bruh. He wants people to notice him. I'm gonna go down this path. Pretty girls to notice. So I stopped playing football instead of smoke spliffs. Didn't have a clue, you see. Got done for truancy. Mommy used to go sit. Did you know this? A sky's PE for a whole. Got done for truancy. Mommy used to something. Got done for truancy. Mommy used to go sit. Did you oh, know I this? Know a sky's PE for a whole year. Went music instead and no one noticed. Happy that I wrote this. Sometimes life's poison. Music's what the antidote is. I remember Ooh. Grand Canary and playing Go Fish. Trying to Let's show life from my angle. I spent most of my school days in a triangle. Young and hopeful. There's some times that I've been hopeless. Times that I've. Oh my. I spent. Like he had no corners, is that what he's saying? I don't know, I don't know. No 90 degrees, I don't know. I can't get the triangle reference. Scenario and playing go fish, trying to show life from my angle. I spent most of my school days in a triangle, young and hopeful. There's some times that I've been hopeless. Did he mean double meaning like a triangle? I don't know. I spent most of my school days in a triangle, young and hopeful. There's some times that I've been hopeless, times that I've been homeless. I do music for the passion. If I make it, that's a bonus. Damn, no word, one's... bro. There's times that I've been hopeless, there's times that I've been homeless. Word. I always said when my ex-girlfriend pretty much kicked me out of the house, I had nowhere to go, man. But hanging on to them dreams, baby. Let's go. Times that I've been homeless, I do music for the passion. If I make it, that's a bonus. Word. Chilling on my loners. Friends ain't friends when you realize the cobras. Mm -hmm. Walking around with holes in my loafers. Years later, I'd be surfing on them sofas. I didn't do this for bread. Years later, I'd be surf surfing on them sofas. Like, I finally got a plate. Like, I'm, I don't have a home, but I'm out here. With holes in my loafers. Years later, I'd be surfing on them sofas. I didn't do this for bread like toasters. I'm just having a laugh. I ain't chilling with no jokers. And furthermore, I ain't chilling with no smokers. Gotta keep my focus. Damn, Try and stay healthy. Maybe up, you're bro. looking the lotus or some other kind of motors on the balcony on holiday with friends and Coca Colas. All these youths who can't live without the iPhone. When I was young, we had some massive motor rollers. 
Yeah, the Last razors, ways are bro. quite strange Cause times change Been inside caged on nice days I used to care about high grade My wage and five mates Now I'm just happy I'm alive, mate Yeah I used to care about high grade My mates and all that All that clicked up stuff That you all worry about Which really at the end of the day Don't mean nothing High grade my wage and five mates Now I'm just happy I'm alive, mate Yeah me and Lucky used to do the dam. We were young as Robin, man, and blazing on that Buddha plant. Damn. Used to tell shotters, yo, be careful with that food you slang. It was hungry times, lived in hostels, would move to man. We realized we weren't made of glass. No lies, started jacking phones to meet people. Ooh, throwing them rocks, baby. Man. We realized we weren't made of glass. No lies, started jacking phones to meet paper fast. And now tries and Sony Ericsson's would lay you flat. Ooh. And no more hostels, Carl Lucky must have gained a flat. Shouts to my brother Stiff. I click was mad as fuck. Was always on some other shit. A town of norms boxed off. 23 were running it. Bag of man were linking every day just for the fun of it. Was on the run for time, G. Man, we're linking every day just for the fun of it. <clears throat> Out here doing the same thing every day. Not really making the same, not doing anything, but all this linking up here talking crap. 23 were running it, bag of man were linking every day just for the fun of it. Was on the run for time, G. Where was they never knew, got latched though. Keith didn't know who to send a letter to. All well, I could see was fields, wishing that I had the better view. Bailed and I was back out on the road where I was selling food. Never learned my lesson, still had rather bread or two. Moving hella loose, touched October, I was sentenced, I was well amused. Me and Stiff were padded up. That's the sad part about this, man. I got out here and started robbing again. I didn't learn my lesson lesson and that's what I've said before man how are you supposed to learn like if this is all you know how are you supposed to know to do any different that's why I always say like I never hate on people for being stuck in this or being born in this or choosing this life it's a hard thing it's like me I live I come from a generation of people that work dead-end jobs and now I still work a dead-end job it's one of those things if it's generational and generational it's hard to get out of that same cycle it doesn't matter what it is it could be a prison cycle could be dead-end job cycle could be whatever it's hard to get out of it if it's all you know Bread or two, moving hella loose, touched October, I was sentenced, I was well amused. Me and Stiff were padded up, a bag of man got padded up, I left my pad mate with all the shower gels I never used. Damn, bro. There's more to life, can't be asked to preach, you get the point like a porcupine. Feel for anyone who's lost a friend, I'd be mortified. I pray I see my loved ones reach at least 45. Let's In go, beef, man. F reaching for that 45, just because the guy's talking shit, telling porcupines. Fly past him in a sporty ride and show your mum you're good. <laughs> F that naughty side. Damn right, bro. Really find my Fly by him in a naughty ride. You dang right. Let all them haters do this. Cause you wanna know what they're doing? They're doing this. They're not going anywhere. In a sporty ride and show your mum you're good. F that naughty side. I've really found myself on me now. Used to blaze piff every day and it would zone me out. Thanks to that, my health crap and I'm all bony now. If you see me and didn't know me, you'd think I'd go me out. I used Damn, to hit from B&Bs, they used to throw me out. Every time I'm walking down the street, they want to scope me out. I show too much love. Bag of brothers owe me pounds, but you're talking shit about me, fam. You need to sew your mouth. Brainwashed into thinking you're a gangster. Mother brought you into this world, you never thanked her. How do you think she feels Ooh. when you go and pinch some wheels or when you're robbing and shotting and linking little girls? Oh, dang, bro. I don't even know who he's talking about because this came out almost 10 years ago, but he does make a point, bro. How are you going to be claim you a gangster, but you ain't never even thank your mama? Come on, now. She feels when you go and pinch some wheels or when you're robbing and shotting and linking little girls. I've been working for a couple years I love to check my pops and have a couple beers Too many times I made my mother shed a couple tears yeah. I can't believe I quit smoking, I feel fucking weird I'm on a positive thing, just trying Good to live for you, normal bro. Hell yeah man, shout out to anybody who can quit it And I know people say weed ain't addictive Yeah okay bud I can't believe I quit smoking, I feel fucking weird I'm on a positive thing, just trying to live normal I need to see the sea if I'm trying to hit Cornwall I hate living in the bits cause this shit's awful All these fucking snakes around me ain't a bit normal most know me as roly but do you know kyle when i say no i ain't talking twitter profile oh i love that dude i love that man it reminds me of when snack the ripper said they just want snack they don't want to know who scott is which I've always wondered, man. It's just, uh, it's gotta be hard. Living in the bits, cause this shit's awful. All these fucking snakes around me ain't a bit normal. Most know me as Roly, but do you know Kyle? When I say no, I ain't talking Twitter profile. 
She got my number, yet they don't dial. I love my mom and dad, I'm trying to make them. I got my number, but they don't dial. Yeah, unless they need some. Profile. They got my number, yet they don't dial. I love my mom and dad, I'm trying to make them both smile. <laughs> Ask me if I'm back that life or say no Cause brother I ain't back that life And I don't shout that high for do me Plus I show love And I don't care what you think cause I'm grown up Dude, I don't care what you think bro cause I'm grown up Where's that? A hundred percent man, oh my god dude This just, this came out ten years ago And you could put this out now And it would still hit just as freaking hard dude If not even harder with the uh, atmosphere that we live in today, man. That is incredible. I love this because, <clears throat> you, of course, man, Master Splinter, Agent 47, you knew that I was going to like this, man, because this stuff is right up my alley. I love it. And anybody who can get out of that, um, out of that struggle, man, I always try to give them strength and hope because it is one of the hardest things. I still, to this day, get my palms sweaty even talking about cocaine or even just being in that lifestyle there's still part of me today that when i get stressed out in my job or something like that even though it's not that hard of a job there's still times man where i wish i could just go back and um and just i hate to say it but be a drug addict because it's not that i long to go back to being a drug addict it's just when i get stressed out in my head i'm just like you know what screw this F this, I'm going back to doing that type of lifestyle because that's how I know how to live. It's much easier to live like that because all your focus is is you're waking up and getting high. You don't have to worry about bills. You don't have to worry about a job to go to. You don't have to worry about what your friend said because if you do, you can just go handle it anyway. And stuff like that, you know what I mean? It's much easier to live in that world. But as Mike Tyson said, being tough doesn't work in the real world and ever since I got clean at 25 and much like probably Roly too you make these choices <clears throat> to make these changes but then every step along or not every step along the way but steps along the way for me man I'm a spiritual guy I feel like the universe is gonna test me like bam you really wanna go this way okay I'm gonna put some stuff in your way to see if you fall back on some old habits just to see how tough you really are Dang, and I'll admit I failed a few times, bro. But now my eyes and my brain is a little bit more open to that stuff, dude. So shout out to Roly and shout out to anybody who's trying to make that change, man. Going on that path by yourself, even though you know it's right, can be one of the hardest things to do, man. So just stay strong and keep your dang head up, baby. I love you guys, and I will catch you in the next one, all right? All right! <laughs> Peace out, y'all.